Hello guys, welcome back. Today I will be showing you guys how to set up Discord with the uh, SP Word. So it should be a pretty simple process because I've made uh, made a simple tutorial. So first step is to press this link and make uh, make a new application. So you can call this whatever you want, but I'll just call this SP Word Test Three. Um, and the second step is to copy and fill client ID. So to do is copy this over here and you fill the client ID in the sh file it says here um, and the second step is to fill client secret in the sv config so I'll go in here it should be this one you copy this and you paste it in here um, the fourth step is to enable developer mode um, I already have developer mode enabled but there's a guide over here to enable it, so it should be pretty easy to do that as well. Um, uh, so the fifth one is to right click uh, on the Discord server you want to um, to link this up to and copy ID, I'll show you. So opening this up, you right click and then copy ID. Uh, and you will fill this in the sh config. So the guild ID. As you can see, uh, you fill the guild ID. The, the sixth one is to create a permanent invite link uh, and add the end of the URL into invite ID. Um, so that should be pretty easy to do. You just press here, uh, any room you want them to start in, uh, you just edit invite link, make sure it's permanent like that, expire never, uh, generate the new link, and then you copy this link. So go back in here and then you find the invite ID so you paste this in and then you remove this part right here so you only have the end uh, 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 and then the seventh is to enter the bot tab in your discord application and copy token into the bot token in the SV file so you press over here and you press add bot yes do it and then copy the token and this goes in here. Now, step number eight is to go into OAuth2 tab and add a redirect link. Uh, you can put any link you want, but I recommend just using the community you have. So this is my link that I will be using. So all you do is go into OAuth2, add redirect, paste this in and save changes. Um, so yeah, that's... Uh, that's that, so now we need to invite the bot to our Discord server. So for us to do that, we need to copy this link, paste it up here, uh, and we need a client ID. I have pasted it here, so I'll just copy it from there, but you, you still have it in the general information too. Um, so you paste it in here, press enter. And now you can invite the bot to the Discord server, so for example, this server which is the one I want to use continue you don't need to give it administrator authorize and now you should be good to go